Well, I'm standing on that corner. It is a festive Wednesday at the Portland Farmer's Market, but local farmers wish the mood was more upbeat when it comes to gas prices. Daniel Price and his wife travel from Freedom to sell their produce at the market. He says gas prices affect things like filling up his tractor, but the bigger impact comes when dealing with suppliers who are charging more to have items trucked in. Prices go up because it's costing them more to get things. That gets passed down to us, but then also potentially added charges for the trucking of things to the farm. Because of that, Price has had to slightly raise his prices. But with even $4 a gallon gas, Kelly Byers, who operates Leonardo's Pizza in Portland, still refuses to charge for delivery. Um, we never have in 23 years of business, and so um, it's something we do. Byers says at times he does have to eat the cost of free delivery, but it's part of their reality. With the food and the gas prices bouncing around as much as they do, it, you know, it's, uh, it is what it is, and if you want to do business, you've got to you got to make the customer happy. Portland cab drivers are spending more, but cannot charge more since fares are regulated by the city. One driver says he would like to see fares go up with gas prices, but that's not a choice. You sit more. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You, you sit more instead of uh, uh, driving around trying to get fares. Uh, you just got to adapt. Um, it helps. Then again, others still have ways to get around this.